Hi guys, the question is, is the middleweight and Dura segment really the killer of big heavy adventure motorcycles? We took Aprilia on a trip. We were interested how Aprilia Touareg 660 dealt with two passengers behind the wheel. I already tested Touareg on a solo ride on and off the road and I must say that I am impressed how technicians in Aprilia did their job. Motorcycle is a lot of fun, great engine delivers tons of joy, the handling is easy also off the road. You can easily step up the game, in my opinion this is one of the best all around motorcycles I ever rode. But for two, is the middleweight enduro segment really the killer of big heavy adventure motorcycles? No, 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 it's not strange. Uribe, Uribe. We took Aprilia on a trip. We were interested how Aprilia Touareg 660 dealt with two passengers behind the wheel. I already tested Touareg on a solo ride on and off the road and I must say that I am impressed how technicians in Aprilia did their job. Motorcycle is a lot of fun, great engine delivers tons of joy, the handling is easy also off the road. You can easily step up the game, in my opinion this is one of the best all around motorcycles I ever rode. But for two, is the middleweight enduro segment really the killer of big heavy adventure motorcycles? The road was twisted, from Ljubljana over Planina to Vipava, where we attacked the Nanos hill. What we get was a beautiful views and lots of gravel roads. After a few hours ride we entered Italy and had a stop in Trieste. Gelato in the city center near the sea is something you need to try. A few minutes later we were back on Tuareg and our next stop was Portroš, so we were back in Slovenia, where we enjoyed a coffee and cola. Then via highway back to Ljubljana. It was a long, beautiful day, but perfect with the Tuareg. So is Touareg 660 good for two? The answer is yes, it's really good, also for two. Nothing will stop two of you. But 
<laughs> yes, but if we add some packs on the back of the bike for a long two or even more days trip, then I personally would choose bigger motorcycle. Why? Because it's more comfortable. That's it. No other dislikes. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. Thanks guys. Thank you.